Hi, I'm Sophie Michelle, and I've been experimenting with Blue Nun wines. Now, I love cooking spicy food, but pairing it with wine can be quite difficult. For a Blue Nun, Ravana Riesling is just perfect. It's soft, aromatic, and fruity. So this dish is great for summer. It's marinated lamb chops with saffron rice and fresh mango chutney. Now, to start off with a marinade, I've got some lovely lemon zest, and just zest as much as you can. Then some ginger, fresh ginger of course, about two inch piece. And now some garlic, it's great with lamb. Just grate that or crush it as well. And then, another spice that is great with lamb is cumin seeds. So we'll sprinkle some of those in and finish off with lemon juice. Again, lamb's quite a fatty meat, so the lemon cuts through it perfectly. And lots of lovely olive oil. <laughs> so then you just take your lamb chops and mix them into the marinade. You might as well get your hands stuck in too. Make sure they're all kind of covered with the mix. And then that goes in the fridge covered for at least an hour, but leave it for as long as you can bear. So in the saucepan, I have a finely chopped onion and a little bit of olive oil. Now you want to cook it down until it goes completely translucent, but do not burn it, because that'll taint the whole entire rice dish. So when you're at the right point, I've got some lovely basmati rice and the all-important saffron. It really does smell beautiful. Add the rice and stir it so the oil coats the rice. And the smell coming out is amazing. Then you add some vegetable stock. Stir it again just to mix it through. And the saffron gives it that amazing colour as well. Finally, bring it up to the bowl, add the lid and let it cook until the stock has evaporated for about 20 minutes. So now I'm making a lovely, sweet and slightly spicy fresh chutney. I've got shallots and chilli. Some cumin seeds again. I like the kind of visual side of this too. Then a little bit of garam masala, it's a spice mix. You can buy it in most supermarkets. Then mango, just diced, roughly diced up. Some vinegar. And some water. Add sugar. Quite strong. <laughs> And you just cook that down for about 20 minutes. So this is when you have your barbecue really nice and hot. But as I'm doing it at home, I'm going to do it on a griddle pan. Now, again, get it very hot. You want to really get that caramelization on it. Uh, the lamb chops are lovely and marinated now. Season up quite well. I use uh, sea salt crystals always. And then a bit of black pepper. And just carefully lay the chops on the griddle. The key is to really get a good colour on them. I may need about eight, eight minutes on each side. Okay, so turn them over. You want to get that lovely kind of griddle marks on there. And then cook for another eight minutes. So when the rice cooks, let it sit for a further 10 minutes with the lid on. This just gets all the steam to separate the grains. And I finally add some coriander and fork it for the rice. It really looks beautiful. Okay, so I've piled up a little bit of rice and I'm going to top with some lamb chops. And then a little spoon of the chutney. And I love to finish off with a sprinkling of pistachios for extra crunch. So there we have it, marinated spiced lamb chops. This is a great, lightly spiced, colourful dish, which is just perfect with Ravana Riesling.